Alright everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. Now, today I'm going to be showing you how to install the shaders pack that I use in all of my videos. Now, I'm not going to keep you here too long, so let's just jump straight into it by what you need to download. Alright, starting things off very quickly, you will want to go to this link. Both of these links will be in the description. I made a media fire for you as well. But you want to go to optifine.net slash downloads. The link is also in the description. And download whatever Minecraft version you are. Now, shaders do the you know you do need different shaders for different versions this shaders that i use is for 1.14.3 if you need any other ones just search up this name and i'm sure you will find the older versions and also with other shader packs just all you have to do is type up minecraft shader packs and i'm sure say loads of them will um pop up for you to use so the first step is install Optifine. You want to click the mirror so you don't have to go through the whole um, media fire process. Once you install it, you want to click keep. It's not going to harm your computer. Do not worry. Ignore the Roblox video. <laughs> click on it and then you want to click install. Now once that has been installed, I'm not going to do it because I already have it. Once it's been installed, you want to load up Minecraft. Now if it doesn't pop up here, you want to click installations, new and then click version and then select the Optifine and then click create and you can name it you know shaders version I don't know it's up to you so once you've done that you want to launch it at least once to allow everything to initiate and load up um, same goes with the Minecraft version if you have not ever loaded up 1.14.3 you will want to do that before installing Optifine or shaders I think that's you know you need to do that before now you've loaded up now you'll want to go to the second link in the description and download. It's a very small pack, uh, so you want to download it. And then, to be honest, the easiest way to get to your Minecraft folder, and I use this method all the time, so... Now after that, you'll want to go to Resource Packs and Open Resource Packs folder. Now this is the quickest way to get to your um, Shader Packs folder. So once Optifine has been installed, Shader Packs should appear, and then you'll want to drag this the one that uh, you downloaded into the shader packs, I already have it. I just uh, cut off this bit at the end. Um, so yeah, and I really, oh, it's already open. Okay, I can't do that while it's open. But um, you know what I mean? So once that has been installed, you wanna go into Minecraft, you wanna launch the game. <coughs> now, once you're in, um, you'll want to go into a world or whatever you, you know, choose to play on. Now, once you've loaded in, you wanna click video settings, shaders. Now. By default, they'll be off, but you want to click on the one you're on. Now, if you see the difference here, this is off. Like, um, look how plain this is. Like, this especially. So, just watch this. I want to turn shaders on. Look how much better this looks. Like, there's just so much more detail, depth, and colors, and I think it looks amazing. So, if this worked for you, please let me know and give this video a like. If the links do not work, also comment down below and I will fix them as soon as possible so other people can do it. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and I hope this helps you out in any way possible.